Welcome back again to another video. This time we talk about how to create a space in iPhone storage. Now, when you go to the, to the uh, settings, general, then iPhone storage, you have a little breakdown at the top of what's taking up the storage. So right now, to create more space, we can see we have 45 gigs available, but it might happen that it's even less. So to create more space, there are two options. You either decrease the amount of files you have or bump up the storage available. Well, for the built-in storage on an iPhone, which is in my case 128 gigs, well, there is literally nothing I can do to expand that. And it's not like I can bring my phone into a, like a service to expand that, the storage, or plug in and a micro SD card, none of that works. So the only option is to buy a new device, a new iPhone with larger capacity. If that's an option for you, go ahead and go for it. But if not, the only option is to decrease the amount of files available. And here at the bottom, you have a list sorted by size. So for example, photos, photos for me take up 40 gigabytes. In case I wanna lower it down, I need to delete my photos and especially the large uh, videos which are taking up much more storage. Obviously, in case I don't want to lose the files, I can upload them to iCloud, Google Photos, third-party locations which I can physically connect to my phone through a cable, whatever I do, or in case I just want to lose the files altogether, I can delete them and get more storage on my phone. Also, there are other apps when it comes to um, you know, the storage, which you can offload, for example. When you click on this app, what you can do is to click on offload, which means that you don't delete all of the documents or data. You only get rid of the app size. So you can just remove 400 gigabyte, the megabytes, sorry, and you still keep the documents and data when you reinstall the app. So that's really useful. So you can offload the app if you want to. So these are essentially your options besides that uh, you can go ahead and literally just you know uh, buy a new phone or get some third party storage but these are the only options hope you like this video hit the thumbs up if you did subscribe below and i will see you later on in the future